Greetings folks, welcome to Teaching Geography in the 21st Century, week number three. I love week number three. I'm having a blast in this course and I'm hoping that you're finding it really valuable and applicable to your own teaching and learning. Week number three, urban and rural land use and forms. So we've got a couple of module objectives. Let's, let's explain what those are. First of all, understand the structure and form of urban settlements. Number two, understand differences among urban models. Three, understand differences in rural land use and structure and surveys and past and present land use. Fourth, understand how and why selected changes are taking place on the Earth's surface. Now we know those changes are both from natural forces as well as from human caused forces. So let's understand that. So what will we specifically be doing here? Learning activities. First of all, we're going to watch a recorded video on this week's topics. That's this video right here. Number two, we're going to have some short readings on land use and urban forms. Excellent. Number three, we're going to have a session where we compare urban forms and variables using the Urban Observatory. Hands-on work with the Urban Observatory. Really wonderful tool. We're going to examine regional change using the Change Matters Viewer. Now this is a viewer that allows us to look at uh, Landsat satellite images from the 1970s to the present, looking at changes, again, from natural changes or natural forces as well as human caused forces. We're going to examine change over time in communities using ArcGIS Online, using a variety of maps, satellite images, and aerial photos. We're going to analyze rural land use patterns using ArcGIS Online. I love that hands-on activity. Um, all of those. They're going to be lots of fun and uh, hopefully valuable to you in your classroom. So the learning assessments, we're going to have, as usual, two different forums. One forum as you reflect on the readings and your reactions to those readings. And then the second forum is uh, res when you respond to your hands-on activities. I want you to respond in the forum so we can look at each other's uh, answers and reflections. Excellent. Now we'll also have a short quiz so I can assess your progress and you can use it as an assessment of your own progress in the course. Alright, let's get started. Week 3, Teaching Geography in the 21st Century. Thanks.